Northern Red Oak. Scientific name is pronounced Quercus rubra. It's in the Fagaceae family or the beech family. Uh, Northern Red Oak is one of the most valuable of the Red Oak species and found in uh, moist, well-drained cove sites, in, especially in the Appalachian forests. The leaves are simple and alternate, as all the oak trees are, uh, and have 7 to 11 bristle-tipped lobes with a margin that's not as deeply sinus as you see in the other red oaks that we'll be covering. Um, while you do see tufts of little hairs in the veins of the axles of the underside of the leaves, um, it's not nearly as hairy as the leaf of uh, black oak, which it could sometimes be confused with. Uh, the twigs are, are red to reddish brown and smooth. And one of the giveaways, especially in the winter or when you're walking through the woods and you see larger oak trees, the bark to northern red oak is, I guess, uh, uh, tight, if you will, um, with kind of white ski trails going down the bark on your larger trees. And if you take a knife and, and scrape a little bit of the bark off, you'll notice an orange-brown inner bark. Also good for winter identification, uh, looking at the acorn. The acorn cap kind of looks like a beanie. It has uh, curled edges and only comes down uh, to cover about one quarter of the nut. And when you start looking at your oaks, it's important to, to notice the, the way the cap goes across the acorn. And there's the native range of Quercus rubra, northern red oak.